So I know one more guy that could shut the shunt doctors down in these first Franklin Financial, whatever, banking, accounting frauds. Joseph Kreese, I went to high school with him. He's a smart guy and he's not a nerd. Associate GCM Gross, Gr Grosvenor. Um, he went to University of Michigan, 7M School of Ross Business. He's a good guy. He ran the track team in Fenton, Michigan. Um, he's GCM Gr Grosvenor. What does he do? Grosvenor Capital Management LP is a leader in the alternative in investments industry. The firm invests in excess of $45 billion on behalf of its global client base across a broad range of absolute return investment strategies. Um, so, yeah, he's, he's definitely not um, a nerd. So he got, he, what did he get? He, he did get the right degree, dual degree in finance and economics, graduating in Beta Kappa with high distinction. So he didn't go to MBA at Walsh like Quaid Anderson. <laughs> he didn't do it. So he's economics, leadership, language. Isn't that like, what, why would you go, why would you get an MBA? Our MBA is like completely ridiculous. Like seriously, can I find Quaid Anderson? Oh, Okay, I can't. Anyways, let's go back to Creases. Let's go back to Creases. Because I can't find Quaid Anderson. I just I just wanna I just wanna make fun of Quaid Anderson real quick. Okay, there he is. What the hell? Yeah, Qualcomm. Let's go Qualcomm. Yeah, Quaid Anderson. What what did he do wrong, dude? What did Quaid Anderson do wrong? MBA, okay. Walsh College, Cost Accounting at Stanford. Yeah. Cost Cost Accounting at Stanford. That's for Qualcomm. I have to. I have to. Qualcomm has to sponsor Joey Kreza and Quaid Anderson because they're they're not nerds, okay? But they are smart guys. Uh, as we unlock five G, we're applying our mobile expertise to transfer industries to create jobs and enrich lives. Sponsored by Qualcomm. They just went down. Who's who's doing it? Who took them down? Who took them down? <laughs> Point five eight. I don't know, but we're sponsoring Qualcomm. Check out Qualcomm. Unlock five G. These guys are all. These guys are nerdy, but they're smart. This was, I have to wait to sponsor some nerds because we have to shut down the shunt doctors, medical malpractice, health insurance guys with Quaid Anderson and Joseph Kreza. Again, let's, let's congratulate Joseph Kreza for being uh, three point, what is he? 3.9 at University of Michigan Stephen M. Ross School of Business with the right degree, dual degree in finance and economics. Did he get an MBA? No, because he knows, dude. He knows everything, apparently. Is he smarter than Stephen Vincent Grassi? I don't know. Well, we'll have to find out. But anyways, yeah, shut down these first Franklin Financial Confederate crooks down in Lincoln County, Tennessee, Lincoln County, Georgia. There's probably more I don't know about. Because I know. Benjamin Godfrey Thomas. Benjamin Godfrey Thomas. Let me show you. BGT. He got, he got jailed. I know. I'm going to leak my email here. Go ahead. You could, you could leak. I will leak my email. I'm going to leak. What happened, dude? Happened. Let me show you BGT so you can prove who the BGT. He's Benjamin Godfrey Thomas. He got jailed in, I think it was Lincoln County, Georgia, by the same First Franklin. BG. What in God's name? Okay, here he is. I'll show you Ben Thomas if you don't believe me. Who I can't show you one guy, the Alexander Ceres. I can't show you him. Here he is. B Benjamin Thomas. You see, he looks like a woolly mammoth. <laughs> BGT. Hang out with Benjamin. You can hang out with him. Um, there he is. He got jailed in Lincoln County, Georgia for the same first Frank Financial, some fake DUI bullshit from these whatever. These crooks, they're medical malpractice, medical negligence, health insurance, whatever, banking insurance, whatever this guy says, apparently. So said GCM Kreza, high school. Kreza, GCM Grossenberg, whatever his company says, investment center. And let's see whatever he says, okay? That's all.